Hi friends, back with another ink vent. This is a great way to wake up. I haven't even made tea. Let's do, we're here at number three. And we've got one here called Early Dusk, which is another standard ink. And underneath the box, I had these laying to try and be flat. So here's Cashmere Rose. It's red, but yet not. It's a bit rosy, as the name might make you think. Here's this so far. I know, we're only looking at these. Don't pay attention to those. <laughs> um, I feel like maybe what I did was like get my nail underneath it like that and then, yeah, and then push it out. I got a song in my head. Engine, engine number nine. Okay, here we are. So, um, I guess I can't talk and write at the same time. <laughs> Maybe not this early in the morning. Looking forward to making a cup of tea. Yesterday I drank coffee for some reason. I don't like it. I'm trying to learn to like it because it's easier if you're a coffee drinker in this country. You can get coffee everywhere. Nobody makes a good cup of tea. But you know what? The thing about coffee is it tastes bad. Um. Okay. <laughs> it's an acquired taste. Which is the same thing as, if, same thing was true for red wine, but anyway, early dusk. I don't know, lighter. Okay. I'll have to make a new rag soon, which is to say find another piece of this fabric to cut up. <laughs> this used to be a bed sheet in the before time, in the long, long ago. Okay. Um, that out of our way so I can nudge that open bottle <laughs> right really dusk oh bad side of the pen Well, something got the ink on it. <laughs> I'm so careful with the tip of this pen. That was the side of it hitting the bottle in case you heard that. Okay. I think it's funny that I managed to use like every sort of 
mark making implement <laughs> and I was like I want to make this easy for myself but it's fun right scribbling or playing with ink so I think I'll like this one I mean it's blue there's nothing like particularly like whoa about this well, that's okay not every ink you know like when every ink is special none of them are <laughs> you know that right do you know that You know, look, this one really like warped quickly. Okay. It's a pretty blue. A bit bit of a tone. But it gets it's it's a bit grayish, you know. I should you know what would have been fun is to do um chromatographies of these right I don't think I have enough strips the other thing I'm thinking is I had originally thought that I wanted to see them on white Tamora River paper well I wanted to see them on Tamora River paper and I'm like oh I'm gonna put them in my Hobonichi that's Tamora River but now I'm like hmm should I put it on white because my first ink mint, I actually put it on Tamora River and then put it on the glued it on the back but that's excessive for something I'm doing daily. That's a lot. I mean, <laughs> my dip pen has seen better days. <laughs> um, found this on the floor one day. I'm like, what the heck is that? And I was like, oh. That's the nubbin from inside my dip pen. You can see, look. It gets, the water gets up in there no matter how hard I try. And a little rusty. Not really supposed to come out, but. That's life. Say la vie. There it is. So now it's just really loose. So here's today, early dusk. What do you think? Some of you will like this. Let's see. We got this dry enough to do the front? I think we do. Did you see that I've been doing this? I can't remember. I don't think you did. I'm not writing the name. If I want, I can write the names over here or something with a smaller pen. I just, because I'd have to write the name with that dip pen and the glass dip pen and I'm not about that. Would not choose to write a lot with that pen. The, so far, I'm not enjoying this progression, but we start off with primary colors red, yellow, blue. I'd have preferred cyan, magenta, and yellow. So you can see why. Okay, represent. Um, anyway, so here's today. 
What do you think? Um, I hope whenever you're watching this, you're having a wonderful day. Take care of yourselves. Bye.